How to add notify me when back in stock in Shopify. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you step by step how we can get this done. Now, Shopify itself does not offer this option. So we have to actually resort to using a third party application. There are going to be plenty to choose from. And I'm just going to show you around a, a little bit about how it actually works. So basically, if you go to products here, if you have a product that is um, out of stock, they get or not they the customers are going to have the option to subscribe so that they are notified when it is back in stock using these applications we just need to set them up so just go to apps and then from apps you just want to go to the app store so we can just go, go click on all apps in shopify app store and then we just want to search for back in stock now here you may need to do a little bit of research see which one is going to suit you best for your needs your business and also your budget there are going to be plenty to choose from so as you can see there's a lot to choose from in here uh, that are going to work the same way they just you know are going to have people subscribe and if they do that they're going to also be notified when it is out of stock so in my case i'm just going to go for something that is uh, down here which is back in stock by zoomy i'm just going to use this one because it does have a free option for me to use and show you guys how it actually works so i'm just going to click on install and then basically we just want to finalize the installation process and then we can just go ahead and set it up now again like i said there's going to be plenty of options to choose from not only this one but i just went for this one because uh for the time being it's going to uh, you know the plans here are going to be worth it because you know we have the free plan and it shows us the amount of stuff that we can do with the free plan and it's actually not installing here for me for some reason so i may need to go for another one so actually i'm going to go for this one now uh for some reason that was glitching is not working and this one also does have the free version which you know you can see and compare all of them uh, as you would like and we can just click on install now hopefully this time it actually does install so uh once you install it you just want to complete the setup now the setup could be a little bit different for you know each service that you are using so here i'm just going to select the back and stock option i don't really need the other two uh, so click on continue then we can just go ahead and actually enable it so we can just click on activate now it should take us to the customization page for our shopify store where, where we will be able to enable our integration uh right from here so app embeds and then you will find it just make sure it is turned on and click on save once that's done we can just exit out of here and we just want to set this up so here you will obviously choose the desired plan that you actually want to go for uh we can also click on see all plans and we will find the free one now the only thing left for you to do is set it up now each service is going to have a different setup process but most of the time is going to be very simple for this one is actually very easy because it does show you step by step what you need to do just go to back in stock which should be activated now and just click on view more reports here you can feel free to customize the appearance but i'm not going to talk about that right now and if you just scroll down to the bottom you will see uh the let's start step by step so just go ahead and follow these steps that are shown to you i'm not going to show you these steps because like i said um i just chose this application but there are many out there that are going to do the same thing and this is also going to include a step-by-step -step process on how to install it so hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching